Your Excellency Minister Manuel Pizarro, Honorable Secretary of State Margarida Tavares, Brain Research Institute President Sergio Almeida, distinguished guests, dear colleagues and friends. We share a vision for a world in which all people have access to quality health services, no matter who they are, where they live, or what they earn. Health and care workers are critical for realizing that vision. The COVID-19 pandemic was a stark reminder of how much we all depend on health and care workers. They are the cornerstone of strong health systems, and especially of primary health care. That's why strengthening the health and care workforce is a top priority for WHO. In the face of significant challenges, from health workforce shortages to migration and occupational burnout, we must align our efforts, drawing on evidence and proven strategies. Continuing education is often neglected, but it is critical. The health workforce of the 21st century needs the capacities to harness innovation throughout their working lives. We must give health and care workers quality education and training, the safe working conditions, the decent pay, the equal opportunities, and the respect they deserve. Because the simple truth is that there is no health without health and care workers. Obrigado. I thank you.